General Store. Always a pleasure to have you here, Paula. Well, it's good now, to be back. We, big day here in the Valley. Oh we have a lot of huge events, but they have to start at Zeb's because Zeb's big yellow store right in North Conway Village, one of the longest candy, count, candy counters I've ever seen. 70 feet with four levels. Now, I know you don't do a lot of sugar yourself, yeah. but what is your favorite? If you could just snack on something, what would you go for in the candy counter? Would it be the old-fashioned, like the bottle, soda bottle things, or wax lips, or would it be the newfangled? Probably good and plenties. The good and plenties. Good and plenties. Oh, versus beers, the fruit and goodies. What is the other one? What's the? It's good and plenties, and then you have the fruit version of that, but I can't remember what it is now. But I don't know what it is. Oh well, yeah, fruit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we have the chili chili cook-off today. Right. We have the Hanna Schneider Cup. But in particular, we want to talk about the chili. Right. Um, great event, and you guys have the ingredients. In case you guys get inspired to make your own chilies, well, here you go. So let's talk about Zeb's, the premise behind bringing these things into the shop. What interested Zeb's about these products? Tasty? Um, they're all tasty. Good. And easy, quick, and you we can like do easy. it in a very um, minimally outfitted kitchen in a condo if you're up here renting. Oh, good. You know, so you can whip can. something together yep. in case there's a game on, Bruins are playing or right. something. You want to mm -hmm. whip a chili together for yep. the crowd, which That's is a right. crowd pleaser, and it's easy to do, as you right. mentioned. Not a whole lot of mess. Soup. It's hearty. It's good. Right. So let's go into the ingredients. What would you put okay. in a chili? Well, these are our chili beans that we sell, the five, okay. the five bean those. chili. Yep. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. He's going to set up the table. Yep. All righty. Display. Okay. There you go, honey. And uh, Kim actually did it today. She did crushed tomatoes, mm. onions, peppers. Um, did she you a little, saute little everything bit of meat. before yeah. Lander? Okay. Yeah. We do soak these beans overnight. Okay. At least overnight. 24 hours is even better. Okay. You know, and that helps with the Is gas. there any way to expedite that in case they're like, oh, I want chili today? Boil Can them. You? Okay. Boil them and then, you know, put them in a crock pot. And they just have to be tender to yeah. the touch? Yeah. Sort okay. of al dente. You don't want them mushy. Okay. You know. And she added um, the Crazy Sticks Cajun seasoning, a little bit of that to it. And she added this uh, Victoria Gourmet seasoning, smoky paprika chipotle oh. seasoning, and that is really good. So both of those. Yeah, and it's and it's not fire engine hot either. Okay. Now, what's the salt content though? Because putting in two oh. types of seasonings. I didn't bring my glasses. That's There's okay. No oh, there's no salt in the salt crazy dish. No MSG too. Yeah. Which no preservatives is the one that in that. Gives a lot of people a headache. I can't, so that's good. You've got young yeah. eyes. Oh yeah, right. But this seasoning comes in <laughs> two two sizes. This one doesn't say. Let's see. Uh, Chili pepper, cumin, pa paprika, garlic, sea salt. There is some sea salt in there, but it's down on so the list about less. eight things. So yeah, so there's that's going to give you salt because yeah. this doesn't have it. You need a little bit of salt for flavor. Yeah, it enhances the other spices that yeah. are in there. And what's this little cute tin? Did you already This is that? the same. Oh really? The same. It's you can buy it in two sizes. Oh good. Okay, if you're not because you chili need a lot every of it. two weeks or yeah. something, you just need this one. Okay. Okay. So we did not enter the chili cook-off per se, but I'm people are going to go, I, I know, but you know, it wasn't my call. <laughs> so I know over at the chili cook-off, you just get little tastes, Ah, uh, you yes. know. Yep. So then if you think, I didn't get enough, I'm starving, come over to Zeb's and th we're just giving out chili today. Kim is serving no her kidding. chili from 11 o'clock on. Really? Yeah. Just go in and just eat Just like chili. we do in when we do the meatballs, we sample those. Now, great do you meatballs. look at people funny after they've been there for two hours, or <laughs> no? We just say, <laughs> "You out of here." Away with you. <laughs> well, right, I this? have to ask my wife if I can buy the seasoning. I go, "Honey, it's not a timeshare with spices." <laughs> there you go. And so, now, if you want a, a veg vegetarian chili, okay, this uh, this is going to be offered today too at Zips. It's Stonewall Kitchen's black bean salsa, and we get it. We heat it up, heat it up, heat it up, really hot. Then you add in these uh, smoked gouda, uh, smoked cheddar mm. cubes. You stir them in, take it off the heat, and keep it covered. All right, and after about 10 minutes, boy, is that tasty. You can really? add ground beef or ground turkey. Oh my gosh, that you know, sounds so this is good. good. I want veggies. that for dinner tonight. And if you just keep this in the pantry and you forgot to take something out of the freezer, you stop by for the ground turkey, for the ground meat right. and beef ground Easy lamb, breezy. whatever, and then you come home, pour, saute that, drain it off, pour That's this so easy. in. So heat that up, put some cheddar yep. in it, add some ground, oh, ground, this, ground and the meat. smoky, you want the smoked cheddar, it's fabulous. Mm. And, and it can we just, get that at Zeb's too often? Yes, absolutely, Good. right in the cheese cooler, and it's mm -hmm. a New Hampshire cheddar. Okay. 
All right. And, and what's this corn thing? You can't have chili without cornbread. Then this is a little corn muffin mix, but oh, cute. you can make it. She made it in low pants can even, this week. Can you week. hold that one up? Because that's really cute. Isn't that cute? There you go. That'd be a great gift. Like this whole package. And when they come in, they want to say, oh, I love this stuff. Right. I want to give it to my friend as a housewarming right. gift. Do you I guys have to keep can... holding this steadily? No, no, no. Oh, good. Oh, well, yeah, I guess you do. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Anyway, that, that's, that's adorable. A lot of it, um, before the holidays, yeah. we did a lot of gift baskets with this banana muffin mix, blueberry Ooh. muffin. They, they all come in these. You are just unkind Cute to little. mention all these wonderful foods yeah. in front of me. I'm so it's a hungry. nice basket for if you go going as wow. it's a hostess gift. Yeah. Or, if or host. Have, host gift. Yep, yeah, host gift. Guys Paula. can cook. <laughs> oh, host gift. That host. Yeah. host hostess. you got to feed the host. Yeah. No, to end it all, though, the chocolate, chocolate mousse. mousse. So cute. I can hold that Cheesecake. one. Cheesecake. This is that you just the directions are easy. It's um, whipped cream. Chocolate mousse. Whipped cream and cream cheese. And this. Cream and cream cheese. But in the spirit of it's the chili, chili cook off weekend, as in Mexico and down the southwest, we added the crazy dick seasoning to it. No kidding. It's very different. Have you ever had like hot chocolate with a little bit of spice in it? Yeah, I haven't chili had sauce? hot chocolate, but I have a friend who makes uh, chocolates and that she puts some cayenne pepper in it. Yeah. And it's good. Yeah, this the, the southwestern spices are very. In Mexico, they do it all the time. Hmm. I can't well, pronounce it. What they call it? Hot chocolate. It was like the drink of the Aztecs. So, yeah. but uh, they also put in the chili powder there. It wasn't there just go. hot temperature. It was yeah. hot, hot with some of their spices. Mmm, that sounds so really good. That works. Wow, you know, cheesecake things. and cheese ball mix. That just sounds so good. Yeah. Now what? And you know, you can use that as a dip if you haven't just your family at home. You just like pretzels. You, or you put it in. Well, no, if a dessert dip. You can use it with little vanilla wafers or chocolate wafers. Mm. If it's just your family, you've all got the same germs anyway. <laughs> double so, dipping. Are you, you recommending dip, double not dipping? Not double dipping, but Voila. you can still go down on the edge here. Dip, dip just the whole family <laughs> instead of <laughs> right. knives and forks right, and plates. Right. Get and in there. That, there you go. Right. You well, know, you don't have on. to make the um, crust for it. Can I come over to your house and eat? Sure, Because it can. sounds like yeah. you just have the wonderful well, thing going on there. Yeah, we do. We have a lot. The kids aren't home this weekend, so I'm not cooking so much. But, you, know. <laughs> you must be like, shoo. No, well, it's great. I miss it. It's kind of quiet. Yeah, oh, when you're used to that hum. You know. Yeah. Well, yeah. all right. Well, Paula, thank you so much. And where can we find Zebs? When are you guys open? We're open from 9 o'clock in the morning till. I think it's now it's going back to six o'clock next mm -hmm. week. We'll probably be open until nine o'clock tonight. Okay. You know, this is the end of the second holiday right. week. We'll go back to normal hours, but you can shop 24 seven online, zebs.com. All right. Well, Paula, thank you so much uh, for bringing so all these tasty tri treats. And we always enjoy having you on. And uh, happy Chili Chili Day. Yeah, we'll be busy. <laughs> yes, so come will. on down after skiing, after sampling, if you didn't get enough to eat, we take care of you at Zebs. Well, there you go. All right, folks, you can find Zebs right here in North Conway Village. It's easy parking right there on the street and look for the big yellow building. Thanks again, Paula. Okay. And we'll be back with Thanks, more Kelly. weather here. For